Hello everyone. In this video, we will see an exercise in Algebra. The objective of this exercise is how does the make group tool works in Algebra. So this is available under the join tab, which is named as make group. So we can make a group of common fields or common field titles which will be there in a table. So we will see that how it works. So go to this input. In our tab, and we have to drag this input data to in the new workflow canvas. We have to connect it with a file. Go to this configuration pane. It will redirect us to the data connection window. Then we have to select the part. It will be a part of the file. We have to select it. Yeah, we have to select this part. File name as sales two thousand seventeen dash copy. Now we have to select a range from this particular file. Just click on select name range. Now select the range as R underscore four. Click on OK. Preview is available over here. So you can find out that Altrix has taken that month, year, record number, and month two. So these are common fields. So they have by default taken it as month two. So I'll show you the database first. So this is the database over here. You can find out that we have imported this particular case R underscore four is the range name. So month, year, record number, and month. So these are the common fields. So you have to remember that whenever you have to use a make group tool, you have to be Having common field name, so the heading of that particular column should be common. So I'll just click on run so that the result workflow will be available over here. Yeah. So I'll click on the output anchor so that we will get this particular output. So month, year, record number, and month. So in the Excel sheet we have seen that this month, year, record number, and month. But in Alteryx it it has taken it in the form of month. Two. So I will go to this particular join tab, drag this make group, the canvas, connect it with the input data. Now it will ask us what will be the first key. So the first key is nothing but month. Second key will be month two. So I'll just click on run button, or you can click also Control plus R to run the workflow, and the result will be available. So Altex is going to make the group by itself. So it is going to make it in the Group. So over here we can find out this. So it is being connected with the make group tool. I'll just click on the output anchor. Yeah. So over here we can find out that it has made a group of April. So under this particular April. The keys are nothing but this particular April, August, December, February. So accordingly, it has make a group of April. So April is nothing but the fourth one. So accordingly, four, four, four. So there will be three groups over here. So it has divided it into three particular groups. So under this particular group, the group name is April, but the key is nothing but all the months. So you can see that all the months are there. So it is taken as random. So in this way, we can. Group this particular data, but you have to remember that the field name or the field the column name or column heading should be common in that particular table. So that's it for this video. I hope you have understood. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.